state investment project for creation of Chernobyl and PP energy cluster was developed in 2019. The main objective of the project is ensuring the energy security of the CHNPP facilities that use nuclear and radiation technologies. At the CHNPP site, such facilities will be operated from some decades to 100 years. These are three CHNPP power units that are under decommissioning radioactive waste processing plants, liquid and solid waste storage facilities, spent nuclear fuel storage facilities, and the new safe confinement with the shelter object. The CHNPP current power supply system has been in operation for more than 40 years. It is already worn out and obsolete, and is highly inefficient. That's why at the first stage a new one will be established, which will provide power supply to the mentioned facilities within the next 50 or 100 years. The second stage is creation of facilities to generate power for all needs of CHNPP. This will comprise a combined steam and gas power plant, a biomass power plant, wind and solar power plants. Large areas which become available during the Chernobyl and PPD commission allow proceeding with the third stage, that is creation of facilities for generation of electric power for its realization. Increasing generation capacity will be mainly by means of wind and solar power plants. The total capacity will reach 1300 MW, that is comparable to a power of a modern nuclear power plant unit. At the same time, the project total value will be three times lower than the value of construction of a new NPP unit and will make 36 billion Ukrainian units. Taking into account the green energy tariffs in Ukraine, this investment project is commercially attractive. In this regard, for its implementation, in addition to the state budget funds, it is planned to attract funds of international financial organizations and private investors. It is planned to complete the project by 2024. The payback time will make 20 years. Creation of the Chernobyl NPP energy cluster will be a bright illustration of the NPP site reuse after decommissioning. Such approach also facilitates remediation of the exclusion zone and the return of the areas contaminated as a result of the accident at the Chernobyl NPP unit number 4 in 1986 into the economy of Ukraine.